In this video we'll briefly discuss, almost all you need to know about metformin. What it's used for, how it works, the dose and side effects, contraindications, and some important advices to the patients receiving it. First we want to know what is metformin, and how it works. Metformin is an oral hypoglycemic drug. That means it lowers blood glucose level. And this is done by three mechanisms. It inhibits glucose production in the liver, reduces glucose absorption in intestine, and sensitizes insulin receptors at sites, in fat and skeletal muscles. So it simply makes insulin works better. And insulin is the key that opens the door for glucose to be utilized in the cells. That means when insulin works better, glucose utilization increases. It is available as tablets in concentrations of 500, 850 and 1000 mg. It is used for patients with type 2 diabetes and may be used for patients with gestational diabetes that means diabetes during pregnancy. It can be used as a first-line therapy to improve glycemic control, especially in obese patients with insulin resistance syndrome. It is also used in some other cases that is not related to insulin such as polycystic ovary syndrome, as well as in weight loss. Usually the dose starts at 500 mg daily, and increased gradually by 500 mg every week, till reaching 2000 mg daily, if it's well tolerated by the patient. Side effects include, decreased appetite, diarrhea, nausea, anorexia, flatulence and unpleasant metallic taste. Decreased absorption of vitamin B12 and folic acid. And it has also one rare, but life threatening side effect, which is lactic acidosis, that characterized by muscle pain, difficulty breathing, extreme fatigue, and more. Physiologic increase in lactate, likely related to enhanced conversion of glucose to lactic acid, in intestinal mucosa. So metformin is contraindicated in severe disease states that could precipitate lactic acidosis, such as acute renal failure, hepatic failure, heart failure, hypoxia, tissue hypoperfusion and severe infections. Alcohol consumption is also a risk factor for lactic acidosis. So, some advices to patients receiving metformin. Avoid alcohol. Metformin should be taken with meals or after meals, to help reduce stomach or bowel side effects, that may occur during the first few weeks of treatment. Take medication as scheduled, so don't skip or add doses, and don't stop taking medication. Maintain dietary restrictions for glucose control. Try to increase vitamin B12 and folic acid in your diet. If you noticed unusual symptoms such as, muscle aches, difficulty breathing, or extreme fatigue. Contact your health care provider. That's all for this video. Subscribe to get more drug information.